Hi! Welcome back to an episode of the History of Fan Anime. I'm your host, William Chow, and in today's episode is a, yeah, maybe a short episode, but it's about the cards, and not, not just your standard, like, you know, what's it, Pokemon cards or Sailor Moon cards or something. I'm referring to basically, uh, you know, I guess variations of phone cards or personal cards, okay? So before we begin, I'll remind everyone to go down below and click like and click subscribe. As I said I'm almost at that 2,000 mark. So again, those people that are just uh, you know visiting the site and that kind of stuff, I hope I've uh, you know earned your subscription and you know go down below and click subscribe. That'd be really great. Um, I've also updated and added more of my entries into the database uh, of uh, the episodes of History of Fan Anime. So again, uh, if you like to go go to that, and you can then look up episodes. You know, maybe you would like to see more episodes about posters or. You want to see more episodes about um, you know CDs? They're all listed in the database uh, in one section, so that you can kind of hit all the episodes all at once, and then you can see them um, you know all together. All right. So today's episode again was about cards, and not, not, as I, said, I don't mean like you know just just these you know collectible cards that you get in packs or you know things like that, or Yu-Gi-Oh cards or Pokemon cards. No, I'm referring to these special collectible cards, and so I went through my archives. And I dug up this little, little little gem of something. This is my little uh, orange road card wallet. Okay, that I've got. And it's a you know it's a, an official Futureland one. So that's the, the people who make all the CDs and that goes for orange road. Okay, so I'm gonna you know if I open it up. Okay, um, it's a, you know it has the places to hold various different kind of cards. And in this one, I have my orange road card and. Another sort of thing like that. So I'm going to take these out and you know, give you a closer look at them. So the wallet itself, again, is a you know, uh, you know, just just a plain picture type of a wallet on both sides. And basically, it allows you to hold multiple types of cards inside it. Okay. So one of the cards I have is uh, you know, this is a very very rare card. Okay. This is my Orange Road personal card. Okay. Now, unlike any sort of you know, you know sort of plastic card or whatever, this is an actual you know credit card like thickness um card and if you actually see the front of it it actually has the number zero zero six one uh zero zero six one one engraved on it just like a, a credit card number was and this basically corresponds to the numbered set uh of my orange road uh the cd box set that i have for that they have you know again the uh, to my knowledge they made they made ten thousand copies of this one and i have number 611. And so on this personal card, you actually have a place where you can actually put your name. I haven't signed it yet, but, you know, and different information about the card. And, you know, basically the information for um, about Futureland or you know, the other people who make this particular card. So this is one of my, you know, one of my very rare people. Very, very few people will actually have probably kept this card when they actually got their sets. Okay. Um, the other card that I also got, which they sold a lot of, okay, um, is this one here. Okay. This is um, basically the same as a uh, as a uh, Lamy uh, a Lamy card. This was a Lamy card, or whatever. Okay, and and they basically uh, released these things the same way they released Lamy boards. Of course, you know Lamy board you use to uh, you know write on without uh, you know writing through the, the current piece of paper that you're writing on uh, onto the sheet underneath it. Right? I did an episode about that. You can have a look it up in the database. Um, but yeah, so this is a card. Um, that uh, I got, and basically, you know, even on the back, if you look at it, you know, it, it has a uh, you know 100 yen, so it's you know it's a, it's a dollar card, and um, and uh, I got it this from any yeah, animate, animus, okay, uh, this card, and so again, it's designed to go into you know a, a picture slot or whatever into your in, in your wallet. So I have in this particular wallet a picture slot, and again, it goes into the slot. And uh, so, so it shows that picture in there like that, okay. And then, of course, uh, you know, the, you know um, I have the place for the uh, the, the, the orange or personal card, and that uh, you know also goes into the first slot of, of that uh, particular thing like this. So, it shows like that, okay. So this is one of the very few sort of you know, the, the types of uh, you know cards that that, that are available. Um, that, that, that uh, you know came with one of the sets that, that you know you can collect and very few you know, as I said very few people have these type of this particular style of card uh, unlike uh, you know uh, other types that uh, you may collect like for example Pokemon or uh, you know Yu-Gi-Oh or even Langreaser for example 
So I hope you found that episode really, you know, interesting and a little different because I said that, you know, I was able to show you something that's a little different that, you know, that maybe some people have not ever seen before or ever uh, encountered. And, uh, you know, maybe that's, uh, you know, one of these sort of things that, again, now has been totally lost and no one has ever, you know, collected or seen or makes <laughs> anymore. Okay? So... Again, you know, make sure if you follow and click notif the, the notification bell on so that whenever I put new episodes out, you will be able to uh, know when those come out, right? So, until next time, see you again.